Stop. Stop my glasses. No. Give me my eyeglasses. No. Uh, 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 uh. Hey, Jesus Christ. It's my eyeglasses. You got to stop. Oh, my God. Come out. Take my eyeglasses. I guess I can, can wear my eyeglasses, I guess. <laughs> Oh, she's crazy. What's up, Tigress? You gonna stop, Boo Boo? I caught the cat. I caught the cat. The cat got away. Like an hour after the rescue people gave him to me, and he was, I thought, long gone. I thought he ju either jumped off of here or he went up to the roof, and I was about to call the fire department. To see if they would go on a roof or got a drone or but I don't know. He must have found a a place to hide on the other side of the terrace and and what keyed me on to it that he was there but I still could not see where he was on the, the other half of the terrace on the other side of the partition. But there was a pile of poop on the ground. And I knew it wasn't the neighbor's dog because they invited me over there to look for him, but we couldn't go out on the terrace because they got the door blocked and taped off, you know, because of the draft. And, uh, but we could go out the window. Well, we opened the window. I stuck my head out. I could, I didn't see him there anywhere. He must have been under something or hiding behind something or... I don't know. He's he's black. He blended in. But uh, anyway, he was missing for over 30 hours. And uh, lo and behold, well, decided to, you know, I was showing my buddy. I told him, you know, I looked underneath the partition. So my buddy stuck his head down under there. And he goes, the cat's right there, Joe. So I stuck my head down there, and sure enough, he's there. So I don't know. I, I think I need to get my eyes checked again. Or or maybe the cat went up to the roof, and he came back down. Maybe. You know? But he's here. He didn't want to jump from the third floor down to the ground. The cat. And, uh... Anyway, he was over on my side. I put the trap, I put the food in the trap. It wasn't even 30 minutes. Bang, he went right into the trap. I left a trail of uh, temptation treats, just like Hansel and Gretel, leading from the corner of the, of the terrace of the cat enclosure that he defeated. Very strong cat. Anyway, uh... He's out there. He's in the he's in the cage right now. Right now he's in the cage out there. I don't want to disturb him though. I just covered him up. I even get they said you don't have to give him heat, just give him shelter from the wind and the rain. But uh, I gave him heat tonight. He's he's got a little heater out there to keep him warm. He's got like four hundred watts. In there to keep them warm, 350 watts, whatever. If once it warms up, it'll go down to 350. That little heater. Anyway, this is the mother cat. She's been going bananas ever since the this cat came here. Anyway, anybody want to adopt him? Uh, contact me. Uh, but first, I think. Because the one thing that the rescue people did not do, no one scanned them for a chip. I can't believe that. They don't have a scanner. I gotta get, I gotta get Officer Cobb to come over here with, with his scanner. And, uh, Give this cat a scan in a few days once he calms down. And, uh, and uh, we'll see if, if he's got the chip. If he doesn't have the chip, 
Now, I'm going to try. He's going to be with me a couple weeks. If I could tame him in a couple of weeks. I tamed her in like two days or two hours, you know. And uh, we'll see. Once I, once I get to pet him and get him purring and to give him a full, full belly, I want him to gorge for a day. So that's what I did. He's going to gorge in there. I gave him a whole can of food tonight. The whole can. And he's got a handful, a palm full of uh, Rachel Ray kibble. And he's got another palm full of temptation treats. He's got plenty to eat. He's got his own litter box. I gave him fresh litter. I was uh, first time I, when he was in there for an hour, I gave him litter that was, you know, my cats were using. You know, but it was clean. But it had their, you know, their scent a little in it. And I don't know, I think that what, what was freaking him out. So, I thought that would speed the process up. I don't know. Well, we gave him fresh litter tonight. And, uh, and he's got fresh food and everything. What's up, Tigers? Look at this girl. See, I rescued her. I rescued this pussy cat. A little over four years ago. She loves me, this girl. She's on my shoulder. She loves me like a parrot. She she's on top of me constantly. She wants she wants to be on my shoulder like a parrot. I go to sleep. She sneaks into the bed and snuggles up right next to me every night. This cat. Good girl, mama. All right. End of video.